Our next performer is one of the top salespeople of Chilean wines. Please welcome to the stage, Tom Kennedy. I have no line with me at the moment. Maybe later. Thank you for coming. In my 20s, I got my last haircut. <laughs> she was done in two minutes. Then she said, Oh, I'll just charge the 295 beard and mustache rate. <laughs> I recently read The Power of Now. It's about living in the present, where there is no past or future to think about. Pretty much like Alzheimer's. <laughs> <laughs> if I can't live in the now, eventually I will. <laughs> I saw a guy walking down the street carrying a gas can, and I pulled up real slow and asked him, What's your name? You could have been an arsonist. <laughs> Companies that hire same-sex employees are really gay. <laughs> I'm not gay, but for some reason my wife thinks it's cheating to sleep with another man. <laughs> Driving to the airport is really hard for me. Whoever put up those signs that say arrivals and departures is an ass. Those signs are for airplanes. They have nothing to do with me approaching in my car. <laughs> I've determined that texting takes longer than calling. Especially when I'm leaving happy hour on the way to pick up my son at daycare. <laughs> I'm in the McDonald's drive-thru, still finishing a test. Drunk or not, who cares? I just don't want my son to see me text and drive. That's not cool. Whoever invented the fruit bowl is an idiot. They're like open casket funerals. <laughs> At home, our bowl contains sweet potatoes, apples, crackers, a few pencils. <laughs> so I, I reach for a sweet potato and my thumb goes right through its skin. Gross. I go for a second one and my entire hand comes out lukewarm. <laughs> I'm not a mortician. <laughs> I mean, Safeway knew they'd die on me. <laughs> I hate shopping. Safeway sucks, and I was banned from King Supers because I had a problem with one of the self-checkout machines. <laughs> Please wait for an attendant. Please wait for an attendant. And the attendant looks like he's got the largest VHS porn collection in our bed. <laughs> I walked out on my entire cart of groceries and road rage to Safeway to start shopping all over again. <laughs> Welcome, valued customer. Please scan your first item. <laughs> I'm kind of petty at times. I find myself debating with my eight-year-old son a lot. <laughs> Pick up your napkin. You gave me the napkin, so it's really your napkin, Dad. <laughs> uh, no. You used it, I didn't use it. How do you know if I used it? Because there's, there's ketchup all over it. You've been eating french fries too, Dad. I'm not as messy as you. As my wife rolls her eyes at her now two kids. <laughs> Eventually I had to play Dad on this one. I told him if he doesn't pick up the napkin, it's going on his pillow. He picked it up. Later, he smears toothpaste on my back. Okay. Maybe I'll wait till you go to sleep 
put all your socks in a trash bag, throw them outside so when, it, when you wake up in the morning, you're going to have to trudge barefoot to get your socks before school. <laughs> I can hear them now. Dad, where'd you put my socks? They're in the backyard. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> but all that's kind of sick. Instead, I waited until tonight. He's out in my van right now. <laughs> He's got McDonald's. I gave him plenty of napkins. I told him I'm going to take him to the Lego movie. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> it depends on what he thinks about the tube of crest I left on the dash. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>